Now, when you think of art, you probably don't think of first-person horror adventure, but that is what we have here today. We are going to be playing the game Impasto, which is by a group of students from USC and many other locations. Um, but what is Impasto? Well, Impasto is a first-person horror adventure game inspired by the works and legacy of Francisco Goya, the revered yet tortured Spanish painter. Set within a world irreversibly altered by his fraying sanity, the player must use both stealth and wits to survive. And this game currently is free, uh, both on Steam and on itch.io. Um, and to give you a better idea of this game and what went into it and who was involved, uh, this is a student-made project created by undergraduate students at the University of Southern California in collaboration with students from Otis College of Art and Design and California State University Fullerton, as well as volunteers from around the world. And of course, a full list of credits will be found in the game. Made on the Unity, free, anyone can jump on to play it. And this got rave reviews by PC Gamer, by the way. It was actually one of the uh, locations that I came across this game and decided, you know what, I should check this out. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. I got some of my hearing back. Okay, so it looks like we have five chapters. The Artist's House, Village in the Painting, King's Temple, Saturn's Cave, and Saturn's Throne. The Sleep of Reason Produces Monsters. Francisco Goya. Spain, 1823. Spain behind. Know that I sail from her with a heavy heart. But the Spain I am leaving is not the one I once knew. War and sickness are everywhere. I tried my best to keep faith. But through my waning health, my body is telling me what my heart tried to ignore. It's time to stop fighting. For what time I have left, I would like to know peace. I hope you understand why I cannot bear to remain in that house. So I'm leaving it to you, the hands of the future. You must be prepared for what I have left you. It will be hard to understand, and at times it may even frighten you. My mind has taken me down dark roads better left untraveled. And even within the best of us, the sleep of reason produces monsters. Signed, with love, Goya Azuniano. That's a very interesting signature, eh? I've never seen his signature before. That's a very close zoom, by the way. With the movement, I'm just kind of like, whoa. But I will say, the, the like paper and writing effect looks really good. It doesn't just look like random typography on digital papyrus, you know? Like, I, I do appreciate that. Wants to move? Okay. La Quinta del Sordo. Explore the house. Grandfather's time in this uh, house marks a dark period in his history. You must try and understand the reasons for his disappearance. Okay, so it sounds like he didn't actually pass away. He just disappeared? Okay. Gonna F that door hard. Let's go. Effing doors left and right. Grandpa would be proud. Okay, so we're at the villa. This door's locked. Hello? Housekeeping. The shit. Okay, demons whispering in your ear. I dig it. Directly painted on the wall, too. Doctor's note, a letter from Senor Arrieta uh, to Grandfather. Ooh, I like that feature. That's neat. Uh, I mean, we've seen in other games, but like they, they've done it very cleanly. To the true court painter, Francisco de Goya, I speak to you now as both your personal physician and a friend, which is why this letter is penned with the heaviest of hearts. 
I know you must seek relief from your inexplicable deafness, but it is a relief that medicine simply cannot provide. I will pray for your health and that the hardship you have suffered does not warp your wondrous imagination. If your hearing is to ever return, it will be the Lord who grants you it, not I. With best wishes and warm regards, Eugenio Garcia Ariata. Okay, so he went through death. So we're learning not only about his paintings, which is actually really dope, uh, but about him as the person, too. Oh, wow. This is... <laughs> got some of the faces on these people. Grandfather's time in this house marks a dark period. You must try and understand the reasons for his disappearance. Okay. Uh, I didn't like that sound. That sound is creepy. Ooh. Wait, are there sounds actually coming? Wow. That's neat. There are sound effects actually coming from the different paintings. Like here, this guy's playing the guitar and you actually hear it. It's coming to life. That's really neat. And you hear whispering on this one with the uh, the demon whispering into this old man's ear. That's really nice effect. Here you hear like babies, children, people cramped up together. I like that. That's very cool. Very nice detail. Oh, Jesus. And went up for a snack. Oh, you can hear it. Oh, that's... That's moist. That's that's very moist. Oh, you can hear the person cooking and stuff over the fire. Or, I'm guessing cooking? Maybe? Maybe it's not? That is pretty cool, Ryan. I could go for a nibble. Blah. Blah. High in protein. It's the other white meat. How you doing, Rulia? A house key, a rusty key. It should open a different part of the house. Put in bag. Ooh. Inventory to... Oh! This is dope! I like this. Instead of just giving like an inventory screen like we're traditionally used to, where it's that sort of um, compartmentalized, boxy menu... We actually see into the bag, which I really like that touch. That's very neat. It's kind of like a similar perspective to what you get with um, the forest, for example, when you have everything sort of laid out and you can go through it. That's really neat. I like that a lot. Okay, so we have a key. Can we unlock this door with said key? Put in hand. Hey, look, it's like a wand. Expecto Patronum. Ooh, Goya's cane. Grandfather's walking stick. He always seemed much happier during the days he could step outside without it. But as his illness worsened, he uh, came to rely upon it more and more. I love the music, by the way. Music is very good. It's it's subtle. It's not overbearing. It doesn't overtake what's happening. It gives a sense of mystery, which is really nice. The King's Manifesto, penned at the end of a long and brutal war. Grandfather had hoped it would be the first step in a brighter future. However, it instead ordered the destruction of the Constitution, mass arrests, and the restoration of the Inquisition. Love the sound tied in with the paintings. And then mix it with the music. Oof. Whoa. 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
I'm having way too much fun. No fun allowed. All right, well, let's Mario this shit. Let's a go. Oh, Wahoo? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit, it's -a me, -a Mario. Please don't kill me. I am just a plumber from Brooklyn. Wahoo. Wah, 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 wah. I am really Chris Pratt. You love me. Please don't kill me. Wow. This castle looks dope. Honestly, like, I, I love what they're doing here. They're putting you in the painting, and they have that painting style, but it's actually very good from a graphics point of view, too. Wow, that's really neat. Look at that. With the skybox being the painting as well. Oof, that's so good. I love it. Oof. That's, uh... That's interesting. Hey, you guys. All right. <clears throat> oh, you look not friendly. Hi. Okay, bye. I feel like you're gonna be after me soon. And I don't like it. I like the change in tone and the background music. And the music is more like... Ambience? It is it's done very well. Again, really, really enjoying it. The art style is really cool. The shit did I just walk into? Okay, I'll be back. Bye. Hold up. It's exploring. Oh, that looks cool. All right, let's talk to this guy. This one looks familiar. Right. Well, you got a lot of eye real estate there, so yeah, I probably do look familiar. Child, name yourself. T tell them your name, Mariano sure. Goya. Okay, that's weird delivery. That that was very weird delivery. Mariano Goya. <laughs> We know you, boy. Grandson of the great Francisco de Goya. And a smear upon his legacy. What? Damn. A smear? Wow. Mean. A gambler. A drunkard. And a disappointment. Yeah, I don't see a problem with that. None of it, honestly, to be real. Just saying. At least I can blink. <laughs> Are you here to make amends? Won't pick his bones dry. Damn. This went really, like, personal really quick. Shame the way he sees you. Everything but what you truly are. No, really, please tell me how you feel. Yet, you should not have come here. Well, I did. I'm here. I wasn't really trying. It was more so I walked through a wall, and then you guys showed up. This is Zaragoza, your grandfather's home woven into the paint, and it stands at the brink of collapse. The town portends the dusk, a coming of calamity. Now, that sounds like something my grandfather did, but you're talking shit about me, so, I mean... This is the artist's nightmare. <laughs> and ye of flesh and bone have no place amongst it. Well, not long ago I was really trying. I just sort of got sucked through a wall. Ask about the masked men outside. Ask about grandfather. Tell them you want to live. Well... Oh, yes. We are all quite familiar with the great... Francisco de Goya. Great. Okay. It was by his hand that we were painted. Pride of Spain and last of the old masters. Pity he couldn't change anything. Look at him. 
so marred in misery that he's brought these lands to ruin. And again, you're saying me gambling and drinking and stuff is a bad thing, but... <laughs> <laughs> but then again, I can't imagine a wretch like you would care. It's not like you did before. Wow. Wow. Okay, I asked about the mass men outside. You speak of the holy men. They are the church's inquisition. The blessed bastion. They roam these darkened streets, purging that which does not belong. They suffer not the heretic. By fire and brimstone, they will make our city pure. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So the boy wishes to leave. I mean, as long as like you guys want me to leave, so I'm just volunteering. I'm, I'm helping you all out. That is much easier said than done. But perhaps... Very well, child. If you wish to leave Zaragoza, then seek out the blind man on the edge of town. <laughs> yes, yes. Consort with a madman like him enough, and I'm sure you'll find your way out of town. Thanks, overly aged golem. I appreciate that. One way or another. Okay. Good talk. Um, enjoy spooning your empty plate and uh, enjoy getting paper cuts. I'm out, bitches. Bye. Uh, the two old ones spoke of a blind man through the alley. Perhaps he can help you. <clears throat> okay, we're just going to walk through the alley. Bump -a -bump -a oh, this is open now. And it's lit. Lit AF, as the kids say. Oh, shit. I'm sitting. She was not always like this, you know. Please, do not blame Faragotha for the state she's in. She was once so warm. Before this oppressive curse left her fraught with fear and darkness. You see, the hope has bled from her and she must be reminded of her old days if she is to heal. Here, let me play you a song from her past. It'd do you more good to hear for yourself. Unfortunately, well, we nice I know only fragments. And the rest is lost upon sheets scattered throughout the town. Oh, well, I guess I can help you. You would truly offer me aid. Thank you. I believe the first sheet still roams around the town, evading all who seek it. It shan't be easy. And the Inquisition is sure to dog your every step. But know one thing for certain. If you bring me music, I can always play. Interesting concept, okay. Start at the sewers. You'll find your way to the sheet from there. In order to escape Zaragoza, you must find the sheet music. You should begin by searching the sewers. Oh, dude, that's kind of a cool touch. I like that. The ability to, like, peek through. I like that. That's neat. Way from the pants by. Hola. No, no, no. Suckers. Ninja, vanish. Okay, follow Tinkerbell. Done and done. Oh, that's the sheet music. Well, unfortunate for you, sheet music, I give a sheet. Get your ass over here. My life through the bunghole. And yes, this is called the bunghole, by the way, for when those wondering. What's up? How you doing? Thirsty? No, nope, keep moving. Keep moving. Run. 
Run. No, come here, you little asshole. Why does sheet music have to run? What is the evolutionary element to this? I am Batman. Hit! Made it. Hit! Made it. Hit! Made it. All right. Don't torch me, bro. Please. I'm very flammable. Oh my god. You are impossible. No me gusta. Okay, what mad person built this? Stop it. Uh, oh, that's not good. The sheep seems to have a mind of its own. You must chase it down. Yep, yep, yep. Seeing that. Shit, fuck. Ass. Oh, we booking it now. Jesus. Hi. Whoa. Whoa. -ho. Whoa. -ho. Hey. Stop moving. Where you at? Stop it. What are you doing? Nope. Stop it. Stop it. Don't like. There we go. The paper has been worn with time and smudged by the touch of fingers upon the ink. It must have been very dear to someone. Ah, you've returned. And by that sound of rustling paper, it seems you were able to chase down the sheet. Yes, yes, I think I'm beginning to understand. But alas, it's just as I thought. I fear that this sheet alone is not quite enough, and I must ask you to retrieve a second. What little good news I can offer is that it should not be hard to find. The Inquisition has confiscated it. Not hard to find, hard to get. And as with all matters they deem heretical, it lies somewhere within their darkened cathedral. Of course, getting into the church district and past the many inquisitors who guard it will not be a trifling matter. Can I borrow your guitar? I'm sure I can smack at least a few of them on the way in. Yet we may still be in luck, for I know a woman in town who may know a way to sneak you in. Even better. Her name is Judith, and she often frequents me in this courtyard. I will go to speak with her. Good luck, my friend. Know that I appreciate all that you are doing for Zaragoza. Oh, hey. He must be Judith. Hi. Those masked fools have not known peace since you arrived, grandson of Goya. Hey, okay, you know me. You seem surprised I know of you. Um. Zaragoza might look like she's fallen, but like a desert viper, she's alert, waiting for a chance to strike. That doesn't sound reassuring to bring her back, I'm just saying. I, you know, people usually try to avoid vipers. Okay. I assume you're here for a way into the church district. See. Hmm. Mm. A barrel wagon runs in and out of the district carrying supplies. That's your way into their domain. The okay. melody you seek lies within a vault hidden beneath the cathedral, built to bury what those cowards cannot simply turn to ash. Once you're in the district, find the priest still true to God's cause. He'll give you the key to the graveyard, beyond which lies the vault. Oh, the vault's in the graveyard. Interesting. Yet beware, the path you take has stolen countless brave souls from Zaragoza. It gives from us all that gives us hope. Glowing meadows, laughter, dance, and old friends, happy memories from a time long gone. The Goya I knew are lost to this darkness. Even one of the old gods met his demise there, trapped within that vault. Oh good, you think I can... Just walk right in. Great. Oh, <laughs> your grandfather was a bit of a rock back when I knew him. What did my granddaddy do with you? Steal my soul, daddy? Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Even in the courts, he outwitted those with more riches than worth, painting them as hideous buffoons while convincing them it was high art. Yet roguish as he was, he felt the pain and suffering of the common folk. He wished things to be better. 
It's a shame what his world has become. Okay, bye. The alley to the right of the sewer entrance. That's where you will find the cart. For the sake of Zaragoza, I beseech Lady Luck to take your side this once. Oh, just the once? I might need more than once. Just, just saying. Might need more than once. Keep going. Keep going. No. Keep going. Oh, he didn't know that somehow. I don't know how. Oh, and we're moving magically. Ah, look at that sky. Hmm. Nothing like peeping through a bunghole. Yep, yep, and yep. And we're good. Hey, all right. Guess who's here? Actually, don't guess, because you'll try to kill me. Stealthy. Do, 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 do. Why can't I get, like, the golden gun with a suppressor? Come on, now. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 And we're good. A priest holds the key to the graveyard. Find the priest and get the key. Yeah, keep walking. Keep walking. Ah, but we can go under here. Stealthy. I don't like it. Ooh, ooh. Oh, this doesn't look good. What the hell did they do to you? The key to the graveyard. Take it from the dead priest. Oh, good. They killed the priest. I am so sorry. You were just as surprised as I was. Okay. Uh, which way? It, oh my god. I. Key. Ah, put in hand. Unlock the door. Open. Score. Open the bag. Put key in hand. Unlock the gate. Profit. Anything around here? Okay. What are you? Uh, what? This puzzle seems to match the map underneath it. The church windows also seem familiar. We may crap. We start the fire. Then we go to the church. Then we go over. Ah, God. Oh. What did I do? I did something. I did it. Yay. Okay, there we go. Hello. A music sheet roughened by the harsh hands of the Inquisition, yet its notes remain. Ha <laughs> ha. Tell me this is no dream. Faragotha, free at last. Oh, what I would give to see this moment. To have my eyes return for but a second. Rock on, buddy. Let's go. Break on through the other side. Let's go. But alas, the sound of freedom will have to suffice. Very well. I believe this is where we part ways. There are few men who could ever hope to depict beauty in the way he could. Yet it is from those to whom God gives the most that he tests the most. His affliction was a tragedy, one to which I can too wholly relate. A painter robbed of his ears and a musician robbed of his sight. What a pair we made. 
Good luck, and may our paths cross again. Okay, peace. Bye. Oh, shit. Everything else has been impressive so far. Oh, for sure, right? Like the lore, the world building. And we're all going through uh, Goya's different paintings as well, or works of art. So that's also like a really neat, unique factor for this game. Oh god, this one. Okay, Mr. Nibbles. Go ahead. Do what you need to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nibble away. What you doing? What's up? Not quite raw enough for you? Uh-oh. No, Mr. Nibbles. No. Mr. Nibbles, bad. Oh, shit. We running. Mr. Nibbles, angy. So angy. Can I go this way? Please tell me I can go this way. Ah, sucker. Nakers. Yeah, recording can be a real pain in the ass. Trying to have the right environment and levels and, you know, trying to ad adjust things in post once you have everything you think set. And then it gets into the game. Oh, shit. He's still looking. Keep going. I am not a snack. I am not a snack. When he gets really angry, oh man, you should see him put his club in his hand. Ho oh ho! But I think that's against TOS. Oh shit, fuck. Ah. He's like cannibalistic Santa. I forgot I can jump. Ha ha! I win. Fuck you! <laughs> Woo! Jumping for the win. Jumping for the win. It's always leg day. Always leg day. This is why you don't skip leg day, folks. You never know when this big old naked Santa Claus will try to eat your face. Fly trap. You've seen my sin. Oh, How hi! I tore my own son apart. Why are you trying to tear me apart? Leave now before my temper once more gets the better of me. Uh, no, I don't want to stay. You seek to know what happened. No, I want to leave. Tis what always happens, child. I grew old and weak. Doesn't look like it. My son hovered like a vulture, waiting to pick my carcass clean. Oh, so reverse. Uno reversal. Okay. I knew I had no choice, that he would turn against me. The prophecy had sworn to me. I was so confident that it was all true. Yet even now, I hear him beg me to stop. Really? He's still begging? Dude's still kicking. Tis this cave that broke me. This never-ending solitude. I see Alone stairs. with my thoughts, I felt my reason turn to dust. Perhaps in the end, Trapped in a darkened villa, your grandfather felt the same. Oh, getting personal now. This painted world was his heart. In times past, it was his hopes, his dreams. Now it festers with disgust at what his world had become. 
He saw the evils in his country and he painted them here. He felt the darkness in himself and painted me. Your grandfather is dying, Mariano. Oh, you know me. And soon these lands will fade along with him. He would have let this world stay buried, defiled by this curse. But you changed that. You found the light he lost. While he was off to play the fool, he was never blind to your many vices. Yet, as you know, he always believed in you. Walk tall, son of Goya, for I believe you have proved him right. Walk or run? That's the question. Walk or run? Sir, do you mind if I get like a just a quick snapshot? Just want to make sure. There we go. Ha ha. Ha ha. So far, I would say I kind of want more. Like, I, I really like the game. I, I want to see more. I like the stealth aspect. I like entering into the world of Goya. Uh, I was hoping for going through more paintings, more of the world, and try to figure out. But they did definitely hit on, you know, the, the feeling of Goya and the view of the world and, you know, how Francisco Goya saw, like, the Inquisition and, and, and everything hitting Spain, especially. And the the graphics were great i mean they were spot in spot on for trying to sort of mimic his paintings and stuff like that and i'm sure for like the budget they were working with and everything else like it's always nice when so many factors come together i think this was just very intelligently done uh and it's very unique it's very neat i would love to see more games like this i would love to see a full-fledged out game where we go through more of the paintings we learn more of the story um you know we come across more sort of elements of Goya and stuff like that. I think that would be really cool. But I think for what's here, it's really neat. It's very, very neat. There are some audio issues, sure. But overall though, like the concept is great. The story is very interesting. And they have some really neat mechanics that are just very nice, very clean. There's definitely a lot of like really cool opportunity off of this you know this is a very good canvas they're working with it's just you know having the ability to fill it out more but i i like it i really really do i think it's neat to try out for sure so overall i think it's worth trying out so if you liked what you saw again make sure to check out the links in the description of the video or if you're here on twitch i will make sure to share the links in the chat uh, or if you're checking out the vod but thank you so very much for checking out impasta with me and hopefully try it out for yourself. And if you enjoy it, make sure to let them know. Give them a review. Give them some love, especially as this is a student project. And, um, you know, encourage them to keep creating. Because this is more stuff of, you know, it's stuff like this that we need more of. So until the next one, I'll see you soon.